starting on the pole in the 57 machine will be Peyton Johnson. Starting third in the 7G will be Gavin Marlin. Starting fourth, sixth, fifth. Peyton Johnson going to be your pole sitter. Top Carter, Petey going to be third. Then it's going to be that number seven machine of Gavin Marlin. The 44, Zoe Smith going to be fourth. Ryland Watson picking up a new spot for this offseason. He'll start fifth. 14 of Brody Meesler will start six. Chase DeMarco will start second. Beckham Malone will be eight. 82 of Billy Corso will be ninth. Wyatt Miller will be 10th. The 1A of Addison Lauer will be 11th. 12th will be Ryder Hubert. The 29 of Liam Kane and those two of Wyatt Coffee will round out your field. So, excuse me, though, to a coffee will roll off six outside of the 23W of Ryland Watkins. You recognize that Watkins name? Ed Watkins, the dad on that one, and he's going to be rolling off P5 and work green flag for your box stock main event. Johnson, Marlin trying to battle it out with Petey. Caution flag will fly. Kane. Lowry and one other gets caught off in that top outside. So Beckham Malone, Liam Kane, and Addison Lowry get caught up in that one. No laps complete as that was going off into turn number one. Trying to get these two drivers. Trying to get the two parts unhooked. The one of Addison Lowry, tough break on that machine. Looks like you're going to have to push it behind the start finish line or push it behind the wall over there. Fit our stock 450s in the grid. Stock 450 should be in the grid. Yamaha 450 should be in the grid for your main event of the night. Nine cars to battle it out for 20 laps in that one. Side by side, Peyton Johnson, Carter Beatty, Gavin Marlin. Then it's going to be Zoe Smith, Ryland Watkins, Wyatt Coffey, and we're green flag racing off into turn number one. Three wide at the line. DeMarco and Coffey, going, they're going to make contact. Becca Malone goes around off of turn number two, but we're going to keep this one green flag. Racing up off of turn number four now. Out front, Peyton Johnson, your leader. Gavin, Marlin, and Carter Petey now down the back straightaway. Your top three with a big breakaway. Watkins trying to make a move on Smith to the inside. Can't quite get there. She's going to hold on to that fourth spot. Peyton Johnson holds on to it. Gavin Marlin trying to track down your leader in that second spot. Him and Carter Petey. Top three pretty much knows the tails. Petey trying to make a move around that number seven machine of Marlin. Now Marlin to the race lead. Gavin Marlin makes the move on Johnson. He takes over that top spot. Johnson back to second, Beatty back to third. Now Zoe Smith at the 44. Ryland Watkins, your top five as they work their way down the back straightaway. Into turn number one now. Gavin Marlin holds on to your top spot. Peyton Johnson in that 57. He sits second. Up off of turn number two, but keep it on that 44. Zoe Smith starting to track down your leaders off of turn number two. Marlin, Johnson, Beatty, Smith, Watkins. Now your top five. Smith gets sideways off of four. Trying to run down your leaders up off of two now. 
Marlins settles into it. Carter and Beattie trying to put the pressure on Johnson as he works his way off of turn number four. He turns to the inside. Can't quite get there. He's going to tuck back up in line. Zoe Smith closing in on your t- second and third place driver. Coming to nine. Laps complete this time by for the seven G. Gavin Marlin. He took the lead from Johnson and hadn't looked back since. And now he's halfway through his main event, the first main event for the box stock division here for the 2022 season. Gavin Marlin holds on to it in the turn number one. No pressure from behind as Johnson and B starting to lose some ground to Zoe Smith. Zoe Smith with a hard charge now. She's going to try to put the pressure on Beatty as they work their all, oh, but she slides big time into three now, trying to get a run off the corner. Can't quite get there. Zoe Smith still working her butt off, trying to get to the back bumper of that seven machine of Carter Beatty. Caution flag will fly. As Miller and DeMarco go around off of turn number four. And that's not what Gavin Marlin wanted to see. Had about a six, eight car length advantage over the rest of the field. And now they're going to be tucked right back up underneath him. I'm pretty sure the 57 knows the move that Marlin put on him and now he's going to have to hold on to it one more time. So it's going to be Marlon, Johnson, Beatty, Smith, Watkins, Beesmer. Liam Keynes worked his way up to seventh from the B main. Corsa, Coffey, Miller, Four, Huger, and Malone. Excuse me, Huger and Malone should be going around the 70. Now we got them lined back up. The 73 and the 9 were the caution cards, so they'll go to the back of the pack. So it's going to be Gavin Marlin, Peyton Johnson, Carter Beatty, Zoe Smith, Ryland Watkins, Brody Meesmer, Billy Corsa, Liam Kane, Wyatt Coffey, Ryder Huber, Beckham Malone, Wyatt Miller, and Chase DeMarco. To round out the field now, and Marlin going to bring them down to a complete crawl down the back straightaway. Rolls to the Bell Pro Shop restart zone. He's going to fire. We're back. Green flag racing. Marlin leads him off of two. Now Johnson to the inside. Marlin's going to have to play defensive in the turn number three. Can't quite get there. He's going to slide high. That's going to allow Marlin. Going to slide back to the third spot. He makes contact with Beatty. That's going to allow Zoe Smith to get underneath him. Smith. Now with a crossover move, Marlin back to third, but out front, Johnson and Beatty nose the tail into turn number one. Beatty trying to make the move on Peyton Johnson, can't quite get there, five laps to go for Johnson. Now here comes that 14 of Meesmer. Meesmer to the inside, he makes his move. Now we got a new race leader, but Johnson's not done with it yet. Side by side for the top spot, Johnson thinks better of it, he backs out, now Marlin's back in the mix, four to go for Beatty. Marlin works his way back to second. Three laps to go. Can he get back to the back bumper of Carter Beatty? He's got three laps to get it done. Beatty out front. Marlin, Johnson, Smith, and Liam Cade after coming from the B main has worked his way up to fifth now. Two laps to go. The battle's on. Oh, Johnson hooks Smith at the line. That's going to allow Meesmer to get fouled. Meesmer comes to third. Caution flag will fly.
As we get ready to go by green flag racing, Carter Beatty going to be your leader. Gavin Morrill and Brody Meesmer. Peyton Johnson and Liam Kane going to be your top five. Miller's worked his way back up to sixth. Seventh, excuse me, course is sixth. Miller, Watkins. So it's going to be a two-lap shootout for your leaders. Roll through the Bell Pro Shop Resource All Green Flag Racing. Two-lap shootout for Carter Beatty and Gavin Moreland. Meese are going to be right there if they get together. Moreland makes an aggressive move. Now he's got Meese to the inside, side by side for second. Meese makes the move. Moreland with the crossover move. Now Beatty's got to hold on. Carter Beatty out front. Gavin Marlin comes to second now up on the turn number two down the back straight away for the final time. He didn't lead many laps, but he led the one that counts. Carter Beatty going to be your winner. Gavin Marlin come home second. Peyton Johnson third. Brody Meese